Hey, good morning, guys. Uh, uh, this is Mega Comrade. Uh, today's date is uh, Sunday, January 31st, 2021. Uh, I repeat, Sunday, January 31st, 2001. Uh, unbelievable. Uh, I want you all to share this video, please. Uh, let us share this video. Uh, the uh, Edo State become a killing zone. It become a Fulani uh, herdsman killing state. Uh, the situation in my local government uh, right now is unbearable. Uh, I am forced to come out. I've been waiting for a couple of days now, uh, since yesterday. To see if any Orion indigenous will come out and uh, put a spotlight on the killing at to go near Orion in the uh, in Orion local government at those state. Unfortunately, uh, nobody nobody cares. I I think so. Give me a second. Just give me a second, guys. Please. Okay. So, give me a second. Uh, it's been a while, you know. <clears throat> yeah, let me see. Austin, how are you? How you doing? Kinsley. Uh, God bless you. This is Mega Comrade. Uh, as you all understand, I've been minding my business for a long time now. But uh, fortunately, the Edo uh, State is now the killing zone. Why? That is a question. Why? Why a do state become a killing zone for Fula and uh, This is what we were talking about during the election. Election is over now. Uh, myself, when I heard this story, uh, I personally messaged it to the governor, uh, Governor Godwin Obaseki. Uh, I don't just come online. When people see me, I come online. You know that I have privately message or deliver the message to to the appropriate channel uh, if they did not listen or they decided to ignore the safety or the insecurity of uh, a dusty citizen that is when you see mega comrade online uh, i told them i said after the election during the election there was no full and killings i told them that this is orchestrated that that was orchestrated uh, by some uh, element uh, of which that they know that if there was killing during the election, uh, the election would have turned out to be a different way. Unfortunately, uh, there's much, there's nothing I can do about it. I have said it all. And uh, it is very painful to see innocent uh, those citizens are dying, you know. Uh, I've just be, I've been killed by, by Guinea Conakry, Senegambia, Fulani, uh, Hesme. Four dead. Two gallant vigilante men has been killed in a good community. They were killed in a good community yesterday. Two vigilante innocent who volunteer to provide security for his own community are now gone. Innocent children. Worry if they were your brother. Worry if they were your father. Where if, if they were your family? Imagine that. These are innocent Edo citizens who are not supposed to be providing security for themselves. But fortunately, due to the inability for the government to provide, I mean, basic security for his own state, have led to this uh, negligence of whereby uh, Edo citizens are being kidnapped murdered, raped, you know, beheaded, and uh, all sorts of other things. Uh, I heard a couple of days ago, a young man was crying in an uh, eastern land, and uh, somebody brought it to my attention that they, that was the same guy that was carrying the eastern agenda. I don't know him. Uh, it's what you, what, you, what you see is what you get. Governor Godwin Obaseki did not uh, did not campaign to tell you he's going to provide security. 
you all know what it's going to do. There was no gamut in this election. You don't, you don't see me coming out calling it a mistake governor anymore. You all know what we are voting for. But you people choose to take money and vote your life. You took money. You collected money. You know? Now everyone is crying. I don't understand. So do you think Mega Comrade will come out today, Iran Omigo, me? I will come out and say, Obaseki, over my dead body. Governor Godwin Obaseki contested for, for this election. He never wanted to do he's going to provide 100% security for you all. Omata Buwa. Omata, Imam of one day, what I. Omata. Mega Comrade came out and told you that this is who I think. Pastor Sage Zayamu, who I think that we provide security. You people said no. You people said no. Election is over. So all we can do now, we, we, we all have to beg him. You all have to beg him. If he choose, he will provide security. If he don't feel like it, maybe he'll spend the money to buy your 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 vote. He's not going to use his head. Anything you wear, you have security. I'm a very honest man. You know? I want them. I want everybody. Now, this, this is close to my home. Ugo community and Iwishi community, we are family. As we are speaking right now, I just called someone in Ugo. He said people are running out of Ugo. Fula and his may have declared, declared, declared kidnapping war, killing war on them. Ugo, Ugo people are my family. I wonder if there's no Ugo citizen in a, in abroad in America. I, I've been looking on social media since. I didn't see anyone come out. You know, if an Anomigo come out, everybody will say, Anomigo is this or that. You people will find a way to give me a bad name. You know, if you want to kill a dog, you give him a bad name. But I can't hold it. I just have a soft heart. Because I feel for those who cannot, who cannot speak for themselves. You know? I think about those who cannot defend themselves. That is the reason why I'm out this morning. Please, you all should let the governor know the situation has to go. Not that he's going to do anything about it. Too. Because, <laughs> after all, you are on your own. That is the fact. So I am urging every citizen, as a do state citizen, I want my state to be better. I want my state to be peaceful. I want every good thing to come to my state. We are begging the government to provide a little he can do. I'm not asking him for too much. Because I know there's no more money. The money that is in state house are not being used for party. They are not using state money to be throwing, to be doing lavish party. You see uh, political talks, cartels, are now going for spring, spring. You know, doing all sorts of uh, unthinkable things. You know what I'm saying? So I really feel for them. As we are speaking, brothers and sisters, the information I gathered and confirmed as of yesterday, I heard it was two vigilantes that was killed. Today, I am not telling you, four, four dead, two gallant vigilante men has been killed by killer Fulani and men. And many farmers kidnap at to go community in order of local government at those states as of today sunday january 31st 2021 so that is the update update uh, like our page uh, follow me on uh, instagram and twitter uh, follow me uh, subscribe to my youtube channel people's freedom movement hashtag enough is enough and i want you all to know that i love you uh, for the past four years, I predicted it. I told you all that Fulani were coming. I told you they are coming from Guinea, from Senegambia. Guinea Conakry, Senegal, Fulani, uh, Ouagadougou, uh, what they call it, Burkina Faso, uh, former upper voter, Fulani has me. Nigeria is now a safe haven for them. Who want to go to Nigeria with this? Who is going to go to Nigeria with this? Who want to go to those states with this? When Fulani can just come out. This, there are good answer. These are not Fulani. There are answer. Answer is different from Fulani. You know what I'm saying? They are different from Fulani. So I said it all. Now there's nothing I can say but to, but to you know, 
to help appeal to the state governor, whatever you can do, as you can see right now, I'm at work. I just came to the car trying to do this video. I'm at work right now. So, you know, unfortunately, in Nigeria, if you are with a weapon, either they call you a criminal or they call you an armed robber. But over here, you can, as, a, as, a, as, a, as an officer, I can carry my weapon anywhere, how many weapons I want. I have a lot of weapons here. Uh, but in Nigeria, I cannot do it. That is the problem. You cannot secure yourself. That is the problem. So you are vulnerable to cockroach. You are vulnerable to snake. You are vulnerable to rat. Even ants, you are vulnerable to them. So, uh, uh, my people, uh, you know, I don't think it's wise for anybody to go to Nigeria uh, right now because the situation mostly in my state, the other day in Asian land, I feel for, for those people. Give me a second. I feel for those people who are crying today, uh, who did not know what really happened. When the uh, election is over, it's everybody's interest for our state to move forward. It is my interest for the state to move forward. Elections have come and gone. So uh, wh whatever individual can do, uh, he should do it. What I can do is to bring uh, the governor attention to the insecurity that is going on in Edo State right now. And I wish I have done one way or the other. So I didn't just come here, uh, you know, try to, try to, you know, uh, you know, bring it to public domain without letting the, the, the principal or the number one, uh, the, the, the executive uh, uh, governor, uh, knowing about it, so we shall have done my part. So I urge every good community citizen uh, to, 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 to do the same. You know, uh, if you know that you are from a uh, Ugo, uh, you are from Ugo community, uh, don't allow your family to be perish. Don't allow them. These are innocent people. They did not commit any crime. They did. They have never do a council law. They have never do a chairman. They did not take government money. Why do you just ignore them and allow Fulanese to be killing them? Like I say, they don't have nobody. It doesn't make sense, my people. You know what I'm saying? So that is it. Uh, I love you all, as you all can see. Like I said, uh, Akaole. I can only do what I can do, you know what I mean? So, uh, I'm not going to force uh, anyone to do what they don't want to do. I told you all to vote for Pastor Osage, you all said no. So, there's nothing I can do. I'm not big, I am not the most, I'm not the most smartest person in Edo State. I'm not the, I'm not the, the, I'm not the shortest man in Edo State. I'm not the tallest man. And I'm not the most, uh, uh, the richest man in Edo State, but I'm the most courageous man in Edo State. That one I can tell you. You can see, they have been fighting me. My Facebook account everywhere have been crippled uh, by the governor of Edo State. Uh, up to now, you can, election is over, but they crippled my, my account completely. Uh, but I just ignore it. I ignore it because uh, I want to give him time uh, to see what he's going to do in this second tenure. Not that, uh, God forbid, if we start tomorrow, they will not say, ah, Iran amigo this one. Tell them to leave me alone. I mind my business. I didn't come to insult anybody. I came here to let the whole world know what is happening. So, I love you all. Share this video and God bless you all. If you go, and uh, do what I've investigated, I don't want to go into detail. We find out that a Wisi community, may God bless them, uh, long live the Nogi of a Wisi community uh, for taking a very good decision. When these Fulani are bringing money, let me use Benin to say this. I want to use Benin to say this. I want to use to if you are a why won't you? I get Billy Eh, go, you are not reable. Oh, okay, can I hear you? A wish you marry only. A wish you marry. 
ya na oke emi laman wa fi ode wa se tin fi e gbera bupo o ke pe ni wa do fi o e iga iga yi me even my own mother cassava am sa fula ni when i had the akato when i had eat it the whole farm that was by the road iga iga yi ni ye me so fa ko i told my mother don't go to farm again o e yi you go e yi yo sugbo a di me ma se ti koko e iwo e bere wa na koko e di mo pa ma se ti e mo pa e my vibe my high my name i say my ha ha good or bad ha o e e o wo pa re we bo e fa re we we bo e ha re we bo e no re we bo ama we to my me no ri ba inu e o wa mi no ri ba inu e o bo o bo ma gbo e se u gbo ani bi am sa se ani ya You know, so every day I do the best I can do. I call, I monitor my mother. Yeah, why yeah, you know what? Hey, you go, amen. Hey, so I want you people do the same. Do the same. Come back, baby, work, baby. You that build a mansion in a Ubo, Jaroi. How many have you built in your village? Eh? You that build one home. Even if it's one, 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 one bedroom, you go and build it in your village. I'll help protect your community. If you want to have a borehole, go and put it in your community. Go to your community. Let everybody go and invest in their community. Where Pavedori, where Ariel will work here. Mind me, Metana, oh, yeah, don't let you because I will hear what you want. Kure, kure, kure. There's no, there's no second city in in a dusty. No third city. No fourth city. It's only one Benin city. Finish. That's it. How can the state develop in that way? If I were the governor, I would know what to do. So, guys, I love you. You have to tell me what we will you can, you can. I make an oil with mountain. We need man I will tell you every time. If I could have a bow when you be, I am going to come out tomorrow on air, and tomorrow we are going to decide where we're going to be doing our online award. So uh, that is it. God bless you. I love you. I want to thank People's Freedom Movement. I want to thank uh, those who have been supporting me from day one. God bless you, all. my lovely brother Fred Adoware, my father in Canada, uh, Parkinsley Odige. May your day be long. And uh, all that, all PFM members, supporters, followers. I love you. This is Mega Comrie. Yeah, Kore, man. Yeah, wow. If you bug wow, yeah, wow. Yeah, wow. Yeah, wow. So, my man, what we're not, what's it be? No, what do or do or do? No, my what do or do or do? So, it's your what's it? Bye. Love you.